Los Rafi Media Vía de Criticólogo continuamos aquí en el Puerto Rico Comic Con 2016 y en, estamos en el bus de Tampico ahora mismo que nos encontramos con The Beautiful, the se, I think the most beautiful girl in Puerto Rico Comic Con, may, maybe, or one of the most beautiful girls in Puerto Rico Comic Con right now, Liana Vamp. Um, uh, welcome to Puerto Rico Comic Con, welcome to Puerto Rico. Thank you so much. You guys know how to do Comic-Con, right? This has been an amazing weekend so far, and we still have one more day. Enjoy, enjoy your time. I'm having so much fun. I literally have been telling everyone I don't want to leave. It's amazing here. I, I, I like that idea, don't leave. Yeah. No, this, I'm going to make a note. This is not the first time we, that we have met each other, right? No, we, it is not. We met last year, uh, October, at New York Comic-Con. So we have reunited here in Puerto Rico. reunited here again. Yes. So let, let's talk about how the whole I, I love your, your how unique your your co cosplays are because you you basically do more horror than anything else. I do. I do. Is that is that something that you sh you chose or or, or I, yeah? I am a huge horror movie fan. I love scary movies. They're my favorite. Um, I would say horror and Star Wars are like my top two favorite things. So I do a lot of horror. I do a lot of Star Wars. Um, those are just things that I grew up with and things that I really love. So I try to incorporate those into my life as much as I can. Did you grow up, you grow up in Star Wars. Which one is your favorite movie? So no. It's a toss-up between um, Return of the Jedi and Empire Strikes Back, but I lean towards Empire. Return yes. to Empire. Yes. Of your horror cosplay, mm -hmm. my favorite is the Freddy Krueger one that you did in, in your Comic Con. I, I know you get talked about that a lot. Yeah. Which one is your favorite? I say I don't really have a favorite. I have a hard time picking because they're all kind of like my little kids. Like I pick characters that I really love, so I love all of my costumes. But I do like Freddy Krueger a yeah, lot. I, I do. I like those claws. How about Vampirella? Everybody knows Vampirella, right? That's that's. Vampirella is a is Vampirella is a is a cult classic. Um, everybody loves Vampirella. I love Vampirella, and I actually got the honor of shooting my Vampirella here in Puerto Rico. Um, on location in front of one of the old forts with the ocean in the background. It was absolutely incredible. So I'll be posting those photos. There's an article that the newspaper did. Yep. It's it's incredible. You people, I love you guys. <laughs> That's good. We're doing we're doing a great job in Puerto Rico with her. So she's gonna come back soon. Yes. How, um, tell tell us which uh, how is that did the whole process? How is the the cosplay process for you? How did, does it come about? How long does it take for you to decide which cosplay are you gonna use yeah. for uh, for an event like this? Uh, how the whole lineup goes? So I don't really have a a process per se. I kind of just do my thing, and um, when I decide to do a costume, it's kind of like an idea that just pops into my head. I, I have a, a long list of cosplays that I want to do, um, but sometimes I'll just be driving in my car, um, like my Puss in Boots. I was just driving down the street nothing to do with Shrek, nothing to do with cats, and it just dinged in my head, and I was like, I'm gonna do Puss in Boots for San Diego Comic Con, which was like a week and a half away, and I had to, I had like four days to make the costume, which usually my stuff, um, I never have a whole lot of time. Of course, of yeah. Course. What is the, this, this, I like the just weird questions, what are the weirdest things that a fan has done for you? Or weirdest, I've been proposed to a couple times, um, and one of my favorite proposals was at a convention in Texas, and the guy proposed to me with a ring pop. And I really like candy, so I, I don't think I said yes, but I do appreciate ring pop proposals. That's fun, that's fun. <laughs> um, any new cosplays that you got going on that you haven't done before that you may be down the line doing? Um, yes. You want to give us a sneak peek? I usually don't because um, that's a lot of pressure on me. Yeah. But maybe Poison Ivy? Oh, that's nice. But my take on Poison Ivy, so it's going to be different than anything yeah. you've ever you seen. Do you have a unique, a unique, yes. a unique taste? Yes. That's, that's something that we, everybody has to know. Learn about. Talk about the thing, the, 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 the teas that you have going on. Everybody like, lo loves them. Everybody how, loves how, the fangs. The fangs are my thing. Um, fangs are like my ultimate fashion accessory. Um, I love everything dark, spooky. I love vampires, and it's kind of my thing. I love them too. Yeah, thank yeah, I you. Love, I love the whole, I love the whole look. Thank you for being, for you for the first time. So much for thank you for time. being with us. Thank you for being with us. Just say hi to everybody. Hi everybody. Kisses. Bye bye. <laughs> Continue aquí. No te vayan. Thank you.